the notification button for more information from African politics, economy, and cultural review. And the banks of the Zambes, the giant Zambes liver between the nations of Zambia and Botswana, the Kazungula mega project and the flagship of the SADC has been born. The Kazungula bridge is the 923 meter long bridge which is incorporated with the road services and the railway and the future railway project that will be built. The Kazungula bridge is the mega project as those in the in Tanzania of the standard gauge railway project that is aimed at integrating the northern corridor and that will integrate the Tanzania port to Rwanda, Burundi and the Diara Congo. And so the Kazungula Bridge is aimed at integrating the northern and southern corridor that integrates the countries of Mozambique, Tanzania, Malawi, Zambia, Zimbabwe, Botswana, South Africa and the Esotin. The Kazungula Bridge is the mega project that is aimed at reducing the freight time of crossing the Zambez River and the passenger checking time in the border between Zambia and Botswana and uh, will ensure that the passage of transit and uh, passengers will be effective and will take a short time that will ensure that uh, the ease of doing business across the Sadek region. Also the Kasungra Bridge is the one that is aimed at uh, integrating these countries and facilitating business between the countries in the Sadek region. As you know that uh, the Sub-Sahara region is one of the region having the large number of population and with large number of population you expect uh, the availability of market and so the movement of goods and movement of people is a key component in making sure that uh, the southern the sub-saharan region is moving economically and transforming the lives of the people in the region the kazungura bridge also is one of the key components in putting the African continental free trade area into practicality. And we do believe that uh, the African free continental free trade area is the right movement that has been taken by the AU and the African countries that facilitating business between countries in the continent and because the Zambes liver is one of the giant rivers in the continent and ferries and pantons will not have been the right way of doing business across this river and across the two countries of Zambia and Botswana. So the Kazungula Bridge is the key solution into integrating the countries in the SADC and, the inter and uh, facilitating business between countries in the continent and in the region. Also the Kazungula Bridge is the futuristic project that is aimed at uh, integrating the railway the railway system in the future and also the railway 
project, the railway system has been integrated in the river. So the river is will be providing a railway system runway and also the road system for trucks and 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 and, and, and uh, pedestrians. So the project is futuristic and uh, is aiming not solving the current problem but is aiming at uh, solving the future problem and uh, solving and uh, facilitating the accessibility in the future so the project also is presumed to bring another project the railroad project between Zanzibar, Zanz Zambia and Botswana so it's such a blessing project is such a, a project that is aiming 20 is aiming 5 to 10 to 15 and 25 years to come and that will be used from those years according to the needs and the demands of the time to come so it's one of the time traveling projects and we are sure that uh, the project will see the maximum fruition of what has been aimed of bringing the profit to the countries of Zambia and bring to the land revenue to the countries to both countries and from its initiation in initiation in 2012 and uh, conducting and starting the um, the construction in 2014 and in 2021, the inauguration of the bridge has been done and we hope that the project will bring much of the adventure and advantage into the region and we are sure that the SADC as one of the of the region having more of natural resources having the fertile soil having having giant rivers so there much of them there must be much of uh, exploration and uh, integration of the countries to ensure the doing of business inter inter region wise and the intra continental wise and ensuring these two these countries in the Sadiq region involve fully in doing business between themselves between among each other and making sure that uh, the circulation of the carries is the key part into development so we should not allow uh, the lion imported goods from China, from Europe and from the America. We should make sure that the available resources and the available raw materials in the between these countries is circulating and ensuring the flow of income and making the business as a key component of integration and friendship between these countries also with the ongoing construction of the standard gauge railway in uh, tanzania that was uh, 160 kilometer per hour speed and fully electric run that is aimed at integrating the northern corridor and uh, other projects that are going uh, are in the pipeline in the in the in, in, in neighboring countries and the and the Angola Tanzania railway project that is still in the pipeline. All these projects that are if will be constructed and uh, f and completed on time, we are sure that the Africa, the African continental free trade area will be put into maximum effect and uh, we'll see the immense rise of the African continent economically and the integration of the people of Africa and uh, it's quite a, it's quite a move that 
Africans do expect it from the governments of Africa. That's it from Afropolitics. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and you turn on the notification button for more information from Africa.